This is, kiddo. A fruit juice store? How rude! Especially since we're here to help! Help? Oh, yes. You're the acting Grandmaster's new hotshot helper, aren't you? Uh, that's one way of putting it, but... Great. Tell Jean I need my quarterly tax return forms, then. It's time to get Elzer on to doing the accounts again. I must say, though, the tax rate on alcohol in Mondstadt is pretty steep. That's mostly down to Master D. Luke's successful business model. Why are the accounts with Jean? Does she do bookkeeping now, too? Acting Grandmaster Jean personally goes over all the accounts. After all, the wine industry is Mondstadt's main source of income. Jean takes great pains to make sure no detail is overlooked. I never knew that. Jean's job is even harder than it seems. The acting Grandmaster's hard work indeed makes our lives a whole lot easier. We're certainly very lucky, but to put it bluntly, we just take it for granted that that's the norm now. Wow! How do you sleep at night knowing how much pressure you put Jean under? <sighs> when you put it like that, I do feel quite ashamed. I suppose I should give her one on the house next time she's here. Although, I doubt the acting Grand Master even has the time to spare for that. Sounds like a poor excuse to deny Jean a free drink. Come on, let's go and see Jean. You've got to try Don Winery's Jules from Liyue. <laughs> Come take a look. Have you seen it? No, not her. I imagine Diona's probably still in the tavern. I mean, little Princey. Prince was just home, now he's gone. Did you seriously think Diona was a house cat? <sighs> this is a bit worrying. What if Prince can't find his way home? a big softy. But aren't we in the middle of something? Sarah and Charles need our help urgently, too. Let's go and see Jean first. You're on the way to see Jean? What a coincidence. I thought you were looking for a cat. Yes, I wanted to see if Jean could help look for my cat. Seriously? You want Jean to help look for your cat? What's wrong with that? Jean's a really nice person. Please mention it to Jean for me. I'll treat you to a brew at Cat's Tail later. Hey! Hey! Ugh, unbelievable! Guess the case of Prince the Missing Cat is now added to the agenda for our meeting with Jean! <coughs> uh, acting Grandmaster? Uh. Oh, uh, Master Jean? <gasps> oh, 
Oh, it's our honorary knight. Sorry, I must have been daydreaming. How can I assist? Actually, it's not us who need your help. It's a bunch of other people. I see. Well, thank you for your service to the people of Mondstadt. <coughs> I have made a note of these commissions in my files, and I will <coughs> make arrangements accordingly. Great! We didn't miss out on anyone's commissions, did we? Sarah's Hilly Churls, Charles' Tax Return, Margaret's Cat. Seems that's everything. We'll be on our way then, Jean. Jean, are you okay? How's Jean holding up? Is it serious? It's just burnout from work stress. She'll be fine after a good old rest. Thanks for bringing her here. She may have tried to keep soldiering on otherwise. It's not a surprise, though. She does have a lot to get through every day. Poor Jean. She's always been one to push herself too hard while overlooking her own needs. This isn't the first time something like this has happened. Oh, uh... You think so? I, I I mean, she's the acting grandmaster and all. We can't have her collapsing all the time now, can we? So, so you know, it's not like this is a personal thing. It's just out of love for uh, concern for the greater good. Yes, that's it. What's up with Barbara? Huh. Anyway, you're an honorary knight, aren't you? While the master is down, the knights should share her burden, no? That's a very good point, but shouldn't one of the fully qualified knights do that? Jean has so much to do. An extra pair of hands can't hurt. You should go and check in at the headquarters. Jean will be fine with just me here. Paimon feels like she's trying to get rid of us. Why is that? Nothing. We'll leave you to it. Come on, let's go! I've been waiting for you. I have been informed about Jean falling ill. On behalf of all of the Knights of Favonius, allow me to express my sincere gratitude for your assistance. <laughs> well, the circumstances warrant it. This is the acting Grand Master herself we're talking about. Now, in addition to that thank you message, there was one other thing. <laughs> I must say I like your style. But before we can discuss a reward, there are some things I hope you can assist the knights with. Right. Although the commissions you reported to Jean have already been handed off to someone else, I am concerned that they will not be handled with due care without Jean's personal touch. So I am hoping that you can help out where you see fit. I will feel much more at ease knowing that the Honorary Knight is personally overseeing these cases. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> oh, I have far more important matters to attend to. There are so many things to... to prepare. Those are the ones. I appreciate the help. See you.